I don't think he realises how mad I am. The block of two. Lydia Tomlinson home. She's getting stage fright. Any P2K fans out there? Blah, blah, blah. Hi everyone, it's Monday. <laughs> Why do I always not know what day it is? It's Monday the 6th of January and basically today has been a very worky day. It's like the first proper day back to work. Well, that's a lie because we worked Friday and Saturday. It feels like the first proper day because it's Monday. It's a bit Monday-ish. It's so gloomy outside. I don't even know, like there is quite a lot of light on my face, but it's it's been dark all day basically. Yeah, we've just been working all day. We've got some outfits shot. Um, I've got some planning done emails, bits and bobs like that, setting up for tomorrow's video. Back on healthy eating because, did I just zoom it? Back on healthy eating because it is not being a healthy Christmas. This afternoon, we're about to go to the Edwardian. It's a hotel, it's a hotel in Manchester. It's kind of, um, it's not too far from Deansgate if anyone knows it. Basically, we've been invited down there to test out their brand new spa. It's undergone a 12 million pound a renovation so i mean that sounds amazing doesn't it so it's a five-star hotel and they basically just had a really big renovation we're going to the spa to test it out which i'm so excited about so currently in my gym kit because we're actually gonna go to try out the gym there first we didn't go to the gym this morning because we thought we'd crack on with work and then we can go at the spa this afternoon so we're going to try out the gym first there's a pool sauna and pool showers which apparently is a guest favorite so that sounds really good so we're going to just going to chill i think we're going to set off just after half two we get there about three because we wanted to make sure we had a productive monday before we chilled out a bit at the spa and then we might do a little bit of work later on maybe see how i feel after the spa so i'm gonna pack my things now that i'm gonna take with me to the spa and then i'm gonna take you with me and yeah i'm really, really looking forward to it a nice way to kick start the new year so i'm having to put the lights on because it is uber uber dark today but i've got this bag so this bag i basically got when i went to uni however many years ago i think it was for my first year and it's nice and big and bulky and it fits it's not bulky it's nice and big and it fits loads in it so i'm gonna take this with me because we're we're going to the gym so that means I'm gonna need a shower afterwards and um, because we're using the pool and the sauna and stuff so I'm gonna take my things with me I've got my makeup bag ready to go here so I'll pop that in I'll need some shampoo to take this like a small Philip Kingsley one I've not tried it yet but it's a bodybuilding shampoo cleanses well packing volume I'm just gonna take the shampoo and not the conditioner I think because that would be a little bit much. I'm gonna have to take them in this bag, I think. I'm gonna take a, not that, I'm gonna take a little cleanser. Oh, this one, I took to York. The Alpha H one, it's a limited edition cleanser. I'm gonna take my U45 moisturizer because I've had some skin kind of problems and E45 seems to be the one that's solving those problems. So I'm gonna go and get that. So I've brought with me some deodorant, um, my little tube of E45. I've got a flannel for taking my makeup off with. I also brought this with me. So this is the Rituals Body Cream. The Ritual of Sakura? Sakura. Magic Touch Body Cream, Organic Rice Milk and Cherry Blossom. I've been using this for quite a few days now and absolutely love it. So I think that's gonna come with me. I've got some trousers with me i'm just gonna take these leather joggers to put on with me i'm not gonna take another pair of shoes i'm just gonna wear my gym trainers back i think um a jumper to put on for the walk back so i'm gonna go and grab one now so this is a cashmere uniqlo one so i thought put it on nice and soft after we have been to the spa and i'll also take a big scarf and my puffer coat i think i think i'm all packed up my phone, I need to take my camera with me. Don't you know, pump it up, you get to pump it up. <laughs> um, right, I need to get ready then. You need to get ready. I need to get ready, I need to get ready, get ready. Um, I'm gonna put my scarf on, my puffer coat, and my gym trainers. I think it's meant to um, rain. Insult BBC Weather, the very accurate app that it is. There's rain. 
but I've got a hood, so should be all right. It just says light rain. This is what I've got on now, ready for our little walk there. And if it rains, I've got a big hood. This is my Zara coat, but I don't think it's in stock anymore. But if it is, I will link it, but I, I people keep asking and I, I can't find it anymore. And this is an old Zara scarf. Very, very bundled, ready to enjoy a little relaxation. <laughs> Literally just got back i just changed into some other clothes actually so tired i feel like it's really relaxed me went to the gym first which is nice did a good session in there so i think that probably tired me out a bit and then we went to well we spent a bit of time in the steam room and the sauna and the like jacuzzi thing and tim went in the pool as well but it was so relaxing i feel really like lethargic now and tired and quite hungry it is what time are we on oh it's 10 to 5 to 5 to 6 so i've just put some salmon in the oven i think i'm gonna do it with some veg we've got some like um baby sweet corn and whatever else is in there and a bit of mash as well we're both just exhausted actually i was gonna try and do maybe a little bit of work tonight but we'll see how i feel but um yeah it's been a lovely day i'll probably catch up with you tomorrow because i'm feeling quite lethargic this is probably where i'm gonna spend the evening just like this I've started my new book actually, which I mentioned in my vlog the other day. It's actually really good so far. I might even try and tackle a bit of that this evening and go to bed early probably. And wake up tomorrow, got a video to film and yeah, but such a lovely spa. Highly recommend a little visit. If you're staying in Manchester as well, the hotel, I've not actually, I don't think I've ever been in there before, but it's a gorgeous lobby and then it's got Peter Street Kitchen joined onto it. So if you're looking for a place to stay in Manchester, I would really recommend and a little trip to the spa as well, definitely. I mean, we didn't even have treatments, but um, it was just so nice down there just to relax and use the gym as well. So I'm gonna say Saranara, Sayonara, Sayonara? And I'll see you tomorrow, I think. It's the next day and it's, ooh, it's quarter to two nearly. How time has flown today. Ooh, can we crop this up here? Ooh, very dodgy. You balanced on a glass vase. But I'm just about to start doing some work. I was so tired last night. Like I went really tired to the point where I thought I was coming down with something because I didn't feel very well. But yeah, I'm absolutely fine. I watched the last episode of Dracula, which was interesting. It was, um, not as I expected and not what I remember in the book. I went off on a little bit of a plot twist, but the final episode was all a bit weird and I'm not sure whether I liked it very much. It was a little bit gory for me anyway, but if you watched it, let me know what you thought of it. So yeah, that was last night. Today has been a very full on day. We went to the gym this morning and then straight away, I did everything up ready for filming. So I filmed a winter capsule wardrobe video, which actually took a really long time. And then I filmed an IGTV video, which I've only just finished tidying up after because there's so much mess made when I create videos so it takes me a while to clean up as well but yeah it's taken us to a quarter to two so I'm just gonna I've just got myself a lemon and ginger tea I'm about to tackle some emails but I might put my dressing gown on actually because I feel like I need I feel like I need a hug sit down get through some emails because I've not really done any for a bit and once i've caught up on those i think we're gonna try and go food shopping because we've not done that for a really long time either so that is the plan but for now i need to get my dressing out so cozy so cozy let's try and crack on with some admin <laughs> Off we go. Close the lift on me. 
Food shopping we go. We're doing a big shop. We're doing a big little shop. We're doing a big shop. Not done a big shop for a while. Any P2K fans out there? Big shop with all your reusable bags. Let's go and buy some food. We need to buy some more cheese because somebody, somebody, somebody not naming names, decided to actually take a huge bite out of the cheese. Like who does that? A, a, an actual chunk of cheese out of the cheese block. If anyone else do that please let me know that i'm not the only one suffering i don't think he realizes how mad i am at the block of cheese mm. this is cheesegate just realized we're both in the same puppies uh mine's definitely a lot smaller than yours yeah mine's a very long one anyway let's go and buy some more cheese avoiding the bakery and snacks <gasps> Temptation. Never I would what? never eat that, but you've seen it in the supermarket. I'm on a health kick, I, love it. I know. You're just craving it even though you don't even want it or like it. We're back. Tim's got cricket on because he said something important's happening right now. It's happening. We need one wicket to win. Win what? The test. That's is that like one match? Like one. This is just one. One, 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 a test is w just one off. Like, they've yes. not won it all together. No, it's for Tyler series. Right, I'm going to unpack the shopping because cricket isn't something that I'm overly fussed about. Get it! Shh. Yes! Come on! They won it? Yes! You've done it? Get in there! Yay! make a cup of tea now it's about three i'm gonna make a cup of tea and then start editing my igtv video do you want one Camera, our other camera. Does it, does it work? I don't know, the battery's not. Oh, well, I mean, the, the camera works. Does it stay? Well, it oh, we won't know if it's okay. stable. <laughs> Looks quite good, doesn't it? Interesting. We have got vegetarian meatballs, um, rice, and then some like Mediterranean kind of vegetables. Starving. Very, very hungry. So let's do Hello, in. it is Tuesday, Wednesday. It's Wednesday, and we're just filming some content for our building because if you didn't know, we're actually working with them on a few bits of content. So we're actually doing that at the moment. It's like I think it's about lunchtime, nearly 12. We've got a couple more of the rooms to film, which you will be able to see on IGTV. Yeah, that's just what we're doing. This morning, I cleaned all the house, did a little makeup tutorial thing, and what else? did some emails that I needed to get back to. So yeah, that's, that's what's going on today. Tim's just currently filming over here. pro photographer we're in the gym at the moment quite cold i've got my puffer coat on i think i need to put it on my view of manchester from the gym but yeah like i say if you want to see the tour of our amenities floor in our building um it'll be on my igtv very soon if not already we're gonna finish filming i've got some pictures to do and then some lunch and then blah, 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 blah. i don't know i'll catch up with you in a minute my most frequented floor uh, my most frequented room on the amenities my most frequented room in the amenities floor is, of course, the gym. Um, <laughs> you okay? 
She's getting stage fright. <laughs> so basically, they've got a huge floor, like a floor space that you can actually hire out um, as private hire and do like personal training in there. They've got a project. We're not quite finished filming yet, but we're regrouping for some lunch. We're having eggs and avocado on toast. Ooh. So. what day thursday and last night i actually went back home see my mum and dad um so i didn't really vlog anything and well i didn't vlog anything am i hiding in the window so today um oh he doesn't want no no he's not coming ready today we're literally just nipping out getting a few outfit shots i also want to start my home account I'm gonna start my home account, hopefully today, if I've got time to take all the pictures. But this is what I'm wearing today. It should be on Instagram. It's a uh, Shop the Curator coat. Lovies, uh, why do I keep saying that? Naked fashion jumper, H&M hat, Gucci bag, Lovies pants, and Nike Techno trousers. Oh, I'm gonna show you my H&M cushion. I'll do that later. I'll do that when we come back. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, that's, that's the morning. Let's go. One outfit down. We shot just at that wall there, which used to be Jamie's, but no more RIP Jamie's. It's such a miserable day though, not the best um, lighting for getting pictures. But we've got it done, there's no light, yeah, and really no light, and it's, I feel like it's just spitting, and it's freezing cold, but anyway. Outfit one done, let's move on to the next. Just shot four looks, and it was very cold outside, and very windy, and not very nice. So I'm very glad we've done that now. We're gonna have some lunch, it's just before one. So ready for something to eat and just to get warm and sit down and do work from inside and not have to go outside again. But first, I'm gonna have to tidy all of this because what happens when I'm shooting outfits is a disaster in the end. So I'm gonna do a little tidy with you before we have anything to eat. Pretty much finished in here, just got a few bits and bobs to sort out. And then I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna have, I think we're just having egg on toast again. How exciting. I thought I'd just show you a couple of bits and bobs. On the bed, I've got this cushion cover from H&M Home. I'll show you a bit better there. Let's turn the brightness up so we can see, and maybe let's put the big light on. Yeah, so that is one cushion cover, but I also have this one, which I've actually put on. So that's the other one, perhaps a little bit more subtle. Let's bring it forward so you can see. And I'm not sure which one to keep and that's that one there my initial thought was this one i'm still kind of thinking this one because it's a little bit lighter and what i want to get for the wall is like a light pr uh, pink print from decennia or somewhere with maybe a gold frame to kind of tie everything together i've got this little bowl on here from h&m home as well my lamps are from john lewis and yeah also what we got is a little stand for the TV. This TV was actually given to us. Um, we didn't go out and buy it. So that's kind of why it's ended up here. This stand is just from Class Olsen, but it, it was on Amazon. I think it was about 30 pounds or something. We just wanted something slim and plain just to fit along here. I'm gonna get some little bits and pieces for it and maybe just use that as a place to store my books because I don't want them on the new shelf that's coming in the other room. I also just want to show you something. So, if you follow me on Instagram, Instagram already, thank you very much. If you don't, my handle is at Lydia Jane Tomlinson. Let's focus. Thank you. So my handle is at Lydia Jane Tomlinson. That's my normal Instagram page. However, I've just set up this. So this is Lydia Tomlinson home. Literally just set it up this afternoon. 
I'm gonna do lots of interiors content over there because I've something I've actually wanted to do for a really long time now. I'll definitely be including that in quite a lot of days. Definitely starting up the interiors page. Um, we'll be sharing all my bits and bobs with you. I'm excited to start actually. I've wanted to do this for ages. So I finally got the ball, ball rolling. That's another thing I've been doing this afternoon. I really can't decide between, between these cushions. I think the other one, I think that one looks a bit more expensive. This one, I'm not sure. I feel like I might fall out with that one a bit more. It's very vibrant pink. I'm just trying to see on camera. I kind of like them both. I think that one, I think that one. Um, we've got a lot of black and gold going on in here and a bit of greyish. So I thought a tiny bit of colour would be nice. We'd even bring elements of that into the rest of the room. So there's like bits of turquoise. So I was thinking maybe like a turquoise -y sort of candle maybe on there just to kind of bring everything together. So I'm going to try and order a print tonight, I think. Oh, this is literally how I feel right now. It's too early to call it a day at three o'clock. Is this not what the point of being your own boss is? Yeah, I think that cushion is the one. Let's turn this light off. Yes. Yeah, I don't think I like the black one. It's a bit too black. And we've got a lot of black in here already. My mind is made up now. So, I have changed into some comfy clothes. It looks so horrendous, it's not even real. I've changed into some comfy clothes. I've done some editing pictures. And we're gonna eat now, it's half five. And Tim's making turkey burgers and we're having it with salad and sweet potato fries, which are in the oven. How have you made them? Tell the camera, turkey mince. Turkey mince, sweet, sweet. <laughs> uh, turkey mince, I didn't have any onion, unfortunately, so I didn't have any egg either. So I use mayonnaise to combine the mixture. So I always have a bottle of mayonnaise in your fridge if you do and to create any sort of burger from fresh. I chuck some olives in there, chop them up, threw them in there, you know, a bit of salt and pepper. The sun-dried tomatoes, olives, um, oregano, oregano, salt and pepper, and turkey mince. Oh, you just, and you mix it with flour or something. Oh, just it? to help it combine, yeah. And that's pretty much it, dead easy. Yummy, I'm tired. I know you keep saying. Here it is. So we put a little bit of cheese on, sweet potato fries and salad. I've just had a little tiny taste and it's actually really nice. So let us go and eat. So it's the next day now and I'm just editing this vlog and I realized I didn't really sign it off. If you're not already following me on Instagram, don't forget to, it is in the link below. And also go and follow my new home account. It is Lydia Jane. No, it's not Lydia Jane. It's Lydia Tomlinson Home. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It would mean so, so much. See you in my next video. Bye.